successful kuna njia nyingi za kupita. Mm -hmm. Yes, I'm sure she had dreams. Alisoma natural science okay. and biology and all that. Mm -hmm. Let's face it. Hiyo kazi Tanzania ina kazi. Namwambia kila siku. <laughs> Namwambiaga, namwambiaga yeye kila siku. Mm -hmm. Wewe ningekuwaacha sasa hivi ungekuwa una change of euro na kagua. Uh, that's usually our joke. Mm -hmm. Tunatengana sana na ikiwaambia kazi yako inaweza lakini mm -hmm. I, I didn't cut out her dreams. I looked at the bigger picture mm -hmm. and then now she's now she's seeing the picture I was I was looking at mm. mbele kwa mfano biashara wote kuna visionary kuna mtu anayekuwa anaona mbele kuliko nyinyi watu wengine wote and i saw that na nikamuonyesha yeye sasa hivi akiangalia na kumwambia yeah, you are right kwa sababu we've created the success that probably would have taken us much time na pia nikikuwa mwenyewe huko ndio vyombo vya kama vile watoto wazuri wanakuja ofisini kila siku sasa umenielewa yeye yuko unatoa tu na yeye na yeye yuko huko na kazini huko vijana ndio hivyo hela zipo vingi unakuta kuna huyu ana hiki na hiki na kambili wife yako ashachukulia tu kwanza sikio kwa tuna ule ukaribu tulio nao relationship nyingi zina fail kwa sababu watu hawana kitu cha kuzungumza hawanaga ile common ground ya interest ya kuzungumza that's where most relationships fail lakini sisi tukiwa tuna la kusema tunamsema mteja. Special mimi nakamwambia. Special tuambie ni vitu gani vya kuzingatia endapo unakuwa unafanya biashara pamoja na mwenza wako au either mmeoana ama hamjaoana. Ni vitu gani vya kuzingatia ili biashara yenu isije kaiumba huko mbele. Kwanza uh, ni vizuri umjue mtu ambaye unataka kuanza na biashara. Wazungu wanasema you should know who you want to get in bed with. Ni vizuri sana ujue yule mtu anataka kufanya naye biashara. Ukishajua mtu anataka kufanya naye biashara, jiulize je, huyu mtu ana fit kwenye hii biashara anataka kuifanya? Mm -hmm. Je, yeah. hapo tunaongelea biashara kwa sasa unataka kumuinvolve mpenzi kwenye biashara. Kumbuka kikifeli kile, mmefeli wote. Umeelewa? Mm -hmm. Kwa hiyo kwanza huyo mtu awe trustworthy, unahitaji sana mtu ambaye unaweza kumwamini. Kwa muda yani muamini kimpa kivivi. Kumwamini maisha ya kawaida kwanza yani yale maisha tu ya kawaida acha tu maisha ya mapenzi kumwamini asiye asiye akimbia na msingi asiye hey. akimbia na hela umeelewa anataka hapo labda tu sign contract labda no, mimi na mke wangu tujue tu sign contract ambaye okay no we didn't yeye yeye yeah, ukiamua tu mtu akiamua up and leave akaondoka na kila kitu akaondoka hapa ndio maana nimesema hivi it's mwamini. a very high risk mm. kufanya biashara na mpenzi mm. ambaye hamjaoana au mchumba unless tayari umeshajuana na tayari ule mtu mna, mna maono sawa mna focus yenu ni sawa mm. tofauti na pale ambapo umfahamu mtu vizuri mmekutana tu tufanye biashara akikimbia hakuna changamoto kubwa kama kuingiza kuinvolve mahusiano kwenye biashara